Hey everyone! I know it's been forever since I've done a video and I'm really really sorry because school has just started back in so I haven't really had time along with school and work so I really really apologize for that but today I am going to be doing a video on my fragrance and body mist collections. Now I know that um, a lot of people do these and I'm not trying to copycat anyone I just thought it would be a fun video to do and I will go ahead and say I don't have a lot because I'm not really a perfume collector I'm starting to get into it and my collection will get bigger as the days go by so um, just know that this is a temporary collection video for now but as my collection grows I will do one where I have more fragrances to show you guys so just stay tuned for that and I'll just go ahead and show you what I keep my perfumes on I keep it on this little silver platform dish thing that I sit on my dresser beside my bed and it was actually this thing that my mom had got that she ordered and it had um, some type of antique thing on it and she was gonna throw it away so I asked her if I could have this and this is just what I keep my perfumes on but I'll just go ahead and get started the first one I'm going to show you I have had for a while and um, when you see this you're going to be like wow this is old but it's a body splash spray from Bath and Body Works and it's in Mango Mandarin and I've had this for a really really long time I don't really wear it that much but um it still smells good but um I really really like this I think they do still have this same scent but the bottling is just totally different so that's this is one that I have this is I guess you could say this is more like a summer spring scent since spring is coming up so um, if you're looking for spring scents this would definitely be one to try then I have I'll just go ahead and do this one I got this for Christmas last year and it is the sex in the city perfume and it's in the scent De desire the lid came off it's in the scent desire and I got this for Christmas last year it's in 2010 it is a um kind of strong mature smell so it is a little bit more for like older people but I do like it um I actually do wear this quite a bit so I mean it lasts a very very long time but um to me this would be more like something you would wear in the evening time but I really really like this smell it smells really really good then I have this one I have this Curve perfume and I don't even think they make Curve anymore but it smells really really good and um, I can't really describe it um, this could either be a day smell or a night smell it's by Liz Claiborne they might still make Curve I don't know you could try a Dillard's or something but um, I really really like this it's you like I said you could wear this for a date daytime or nighttime as you can tell I've used quite a bit of it I've had this for a long time so it has lasted me pretty good but um you could try Dillard's or JCPenney whoever sells Liz Claiborne almost every department store does and don't quote me on it they probably do still sell this but I just haven't seen it so I would definitely go to your nearest department store and check that out it's called Curve by Liz Claiborne and they have it for men too in case you're wondering then this last well the rest after I show you this all the rest of them are body sprays so I'll just go ahead and show this um, I got this um, summer of 2010 so this has lasted me for a long time and it's by Frag Luke's it's called South Beach and I got this um, when I went to Miami on vacation and it's a very citrus smell it smells really really good and um, this is more this is spring and summer you could probably use this as a night smell too but um it smells really really good and it's I only paid I don't remember how much it was but it wasn't that much and I got it when I went to Miami so um it's by Frag Luke's so I'm not sure if they have a website or not because I was at the outlet mall down there and they had this fragrance store place and I just picked this up because it smelled really really good but it's called South Beach and I love it I love the smell and it's lasted me for a year so or a year and a half actually so I would definitely try that out and the packaging is so unique and it's sleek and it's pretty and um, so I would recommend this for anyone then the rest of these are all body sprays and they're all from Victoria's Secret 
So this next one I have is called Tempted Berry and it's from their Exotics collection. And you saw this in my haul for the Cheers for the Fall Season and it smells really good. It's just a berry smell. Um, more like a day smell but it smells really really good and it's just when you're on the go you just want to spray something on real quick this is the way to go I really like this one then the next one I have was also in my cheers for the fall season and it's called subductive amber and I am in love with this smell you guys it smells so good and I can't really describe it it says that it is a sensual day sultry nights an exotic fantasy of jeweled orchard seduced by a luxurious amber so it's amber and orchard and you could wear this as a day smell or a night smell and I get a lot of compliments on this so I would definitely go check this out and Victoria's Secret has really great sales on their fragrance sprays they sometimes they do the 5 for 20 or the 6 for 30 so I would really try that then the next one I have from Victoria's Secret is called Pear Glaché and it's not my favorite smell in the world it's not my favorite smell it smells like straight pears but um it's sugared pear and cassava melon and it's not my favorite smell but I mean it's a it's a it's an okay smell I guess is what you would say but it's not my favorite but um if you like really really sweet smells then you could try this one as well it's called pear glaché and then this next one I have is called lost in fantasy and I actually have this on right now and I love this smell it smells so good it's Brazilian orchid and kiwi it's more like a spring summer smell so um, I would definitely recommend this for anyone you could wear this I don't know if I would wear this in the nighttime or not. To me, this is more like a day smell, but um, I really, really like this too. I have it on right now. It smells really, really good. And then I have this one. It's called Ravishing Love. And this one is Blackberry and Lilac. And I like this. It smells really good. To me, this is more like a night smell. But it just, like I said, I mean, even though I say that certain smells are night smells, it just depends on your personal taste. So I would use this as a night smell. But um, it just depends on you, but it smells really, really good. And then last but not least, I have another favorite by Victoria's Secret. And it's called Love Spell. And it's got shimmer in it. So when you spray it, um, you'll get glitter on you. And this one, it doesn't say it says it's the shimmering fragrance fantasy golden glimmer and love spell scent irresistible with cherry blossom and peach so that's kind of a interesting combination if you will but to me this is a this is definitely a night smell in my opinion but that is an interesting very interesting combination cherry blossom and peach I never would have thought to combine those together but um it's to me this is a night smell and even the packaging makes you think about the night time I guess but um all of these bottles from Victoria's Secret they're a pretty decent size they're 8.4 ounces so you get a good bit of product and it's best to do the uh whenever they do the 6 for 35 or the 5 for 20 or whatever because one of these alone is 12 bucks so you might as well get the 6 for 35 and then get the 7th one free because basically you're paying $5 a bottle, which is awesome. So this is an awesome smell, definitely a night smell, but I have worn this during the day and I get a lot of compliments on it, so I would recommend this for anyone as well. But my top picks for all of my fragrances that I have would have to be the Seductive Amber. I love the smell. The South Beach. I love this smell as well. I wear this a lot. The Lost in Fantasy, I would definitely recommend because I just don't know. It's it's Brazilian orchid and mouthwater and kiwi. It's just it's just perfect for a summer smell. And then last but not least, the Love Spell. Love this. Would recommend this to anyone. Um, if somebody told me they didn't like this, I would tell them they were crazy. <laughs> I'm just kidding, but it just depends on your personal preference.
But I just think that that is an interesting combination, cherry blossom and peach. I just never would have thought to put that together. And then on top of that, it's got the glitter in it. So when you spray it, you can you can smell good and be glittery at the same time. So I really, really make those are the top four that I would recommend out of my collection. But that was my fragrance slash body mist collection. I hope you guys liked it. And I will see you guys in my next video. Ciao!